Welcome back everyone. This is episode 21. Or oh, it's actually episode 22. Um, I lie. It's 22. We just ended 21 yesterday. This is 22 today. And we're starting off with uh, <laughs> good old, uh, poor old Yezor, the old man, ever so slowly dragging this gigantic megalith up and over this ridge and he is dragging it this way. Here. We have five already. That is the sixth one on its way over that ridge and across here. And we will be erecting our second stone circle above the city of Mogoroth. And we are doing really well on our expansion here. You can see our stone walls have completed. Um, our stone walls on the inner side apart from here. We missed that one. Let's upgrade that one there. Have been upgraded. We are breeding cattle. We have uh, managed to uh, stock up a fair amount of uh, straw from last winter. Uh, hopefully a little bit more of it will be completed and fetched now. But what we really want to do is we really want to keep an eye on this rolling megalith. Because we don't want to miss the creation of the second stone circle uh, over here on the top end. Of the world and we've got a third person coming here to help pull this megalith so it should go a bit quicker down the hill maybe it'll go a bit faster fast down the hill it should just tumble down the hill but here we go i think they're heading for a uh, heading for the river crossing over here the shallows yeah, pull it across the shallows oh okay i've given up just 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 before and Zegar is gonna have a have a drink before he goes off. And Emma, the adult woman, will continue struggling. She's actually making fairly good progress by herself, struggling to pull that thing, that heavy thing, across the across the river there. Whoa, that was some uh, was some activity going on here. What was going on there? Uh, it looks like there's a wolf. There was a wolf attack. Feral horse got the brunt of that one. Interesting. Yeah, so this is this is where we're at here. Um, it looks like there's a fair amount of plowing being done. The plowing is really helping get the winter winter crops in the ground. We're having no problem making sure we get all the winter crops in the ground. Uh, summer crops, a little bit of a difference. Um, the season is, is tough. Uh, where is that megalith? Where are we? Oh, we are just coming out of the water. We've got a second person coming, coming to pick up the slack. Um, I think we're going to come drag across there and it's going to go up here. This is fantastic stuff, everyone. Um, and what that will do is... Uh, oh, not this, that's that text. We're almost there. What that will do is that will enable us to tick off the... Now get on with it. The three stone circles. We will be one away. Uh, wolf attack. And we saw that happening at the corner of our eye there. Stabbed him. Shanked the wolf. Uh, that'll tick off that. Um... And I think, uh, uh, let's have a look, milestones, knowledge progress, let's have a look at how many reindeer we've killed, or deer, that's reindeer, that's deer, 72. Um, so we still need to have got a fair way to go before we achieve our deer uh, uh, target. Although we've made a good point of air marking any deer that we see for slaughter. Like this, these guys here, these are not deer, so they will escape our... Our sword for the moment. Uh, where are the deer? Let's see if we can find any deer without missing, missing the action. Uh, these deer? No, these are reindeer. Uh, muddy the waters, those guys. Uh, let's just fly back here. Make sure we don't miss this. Uh, miss the delivery of this megalith. It's a really important thing here. As uh, I think Emma is still going strong. And Razak has come to help though. Uh, she's given up having a drink. Uh, it looks like Karen is overtaken. This is good. Uh, taken over. This is good uh, coming out here. Uh, what's this? This is a mine and ore. Uh, are we actually uh, are we actually still mining anything from out here? Yeah, I suppose we are, are we? Um, there's still some flint here. Um, let's pick up that flint. Oh, look, there's a Someone picking up stone, and there's a good old uh, donkey waiting here, helping carry a lot of that stone back. 
Um, and it looks like there's actually a cart here without a without a horse attached to it. Interesting. Um, and that's good news. We have our megalith up, um, which is great. Ooh, our, yeah, our megalith uh, is up and running. And our second stone circle should be almost complete up here on the hill. Lovely position. Looking out over the out just over the, the village out over here. You can barely see it. In fact, you can't see it from down here. You can through the through the trees there. Um, but yes, yeah, feels like a good spiritual spot to be putting a stone circle up here. People will come out to pray. There's been a lot of activity that's happened around this edge of the world. I'm zooming out like this so you can see where it sits just above the village. Um, almost finished this. And I think that's going to take the prestige of our village up magnificently. There you go. Two. Another one built. Um, and let's actually have a look. Let's have a look at where that takes our village. Yep. That takes us really high up here. Um, good amount of prestige. Uh, should really draw people, draw people in. Um, and look at that. We managed to get a lot. I think that's the most, uh, the most I've ever seen, uh, seen us manage to get planted uh, in one go uh, in one season and um, almost all the fields which means that uh, we are making significant progress here yeah? workloads are dropping happiness ra ratings are, are, are climbing workload is very balanced in fact people should be able to quickly complete all the tasks let's have a look at what tasks are going on here yeah that's wonderful hey it's always good when there's like only a couple of pending tasks there. People get to relax a little bit. Um, and yeah, we shall we shall see what happens. Um, do you think that we can... Uh, do you think that we will be able to get a couple of these? Let's let's see if we can take a couple of these down. Um, and get three, three more, three more huts. Uh, Three more hats ready before the next season is over. Um, that would be great. Stone circle up in this in this episode. Second stone circle. Take that one off the list. Um, get these hats up, and we can almost progress to the next edge. Um, and we just need to be hunting, hunting, hunting some more reindeer. Hunting some more reindeer. Um, we actually might be able to do more than just those three, but I don't want to bank on it. So just gonna. Just gonna get those three down for now. Let's get those three down. Yeah, let's get that down and that up. Yep. So we'll we'll jack up the speed on those. Um, we already dropped our capacity here. We only have capacity for 171. We have 177 people in the village, but with the addition of those, very soon we'll have straw coming through from the fields before the end of winter, um, and that'll jump our population capacity. I think up to just under 200 um, in fact we are we have uh, one hut going up now another one going up straws coming in which is great news um, yeah we should be good before winter everyone should have a home no complaints let's have a look as those two huts there get finished up what is that dropping us pumping us up to yeah Soon six. No more space for any more people. We still don't have enough space. We have space for 181, uh, which is great. We've got space for three more people, um, and we've got another one going up here. So that again will will enable us to increase uh, the population capacity, carrying capacity up to 185, I believe, or 186. 186. Yeah, 186. Which is a huge number of people to be supporting inside the walls of Morgoroth. Uh, wonderful to see that our wool outfit counts. We've got enough uh, shields, swords. Do we have swords? Are we able? Are we able to produce swords? Uh, are we able to produce swords? Let's just see. Who? Where do we produce swords? By the way, are swords produced? Uh, swords produced anywhere? Shields? Where well, we're producing shields? Um, and composite bows. Let's actually uh, up the number of shields that we're pumping out here. Yeah? Get a few more people armed with shields. Um, 
not even half our population carrying shields at the moment. Got a couple of bronze swords. Uh, let's, uh, let's try and crank out a couple of bronze swords. I think we need to get this uh, the workloads up here going really strongly. Uh, a couple more bronze swords, some uh, some shields. I really want to start a start a um, uh, start making sure that the settlement is uh, is really uh, up and running properly. Uh, let's get a couple more flint picks out here. We can get a couple of flint picks. Make sure that there's enough pick picks around. We got enough sickles. Sickles are doing a good job. Um, and yeah, everyone's uh, wintering it out, I suppose. Lots of stuff to still collect. Um, workload's quite high, but that's not a problem. Lots of carts here, ready for ready for animals come come the next season to pick up pick up the slack. What was that? That was a wolf in a weird right in the center. I think it was coming for our animals. And this is why uh, this is why we have them in stables in winter. Um, yeah. So how much have we got? We've got straw. We've saved up quite a lot there. So I think um, come the end of uh, come the end of the season, uh, we're gonna we're gonna move uh, our final buildings here, final homes into uh, into roundhouses. Our final huts will convert themselves into roundhouses. Um, no, and we shall have no more huts left in the village. Um, and then I think we shall try and convert uh, our remaining stables here, um, who I think are the last, will then be the last few buildings that uh, these four, five, six, these six stable buildings over here that uh, need to be upgraded. Um, and once those are upgraded, um, we shall progress the next age. Um, I think we're producing quite a few swords here. Always get some copper swords coming out. Copper knife. Yep. Just making sure everything is happening here. There's always lots of production. It's up the up the priority on this uh, on this on these here on these here tasks. So there's always someone smelting and making something. Um, I want to. Uh, I want to make sure that. Uh, up, up the priority along these smelters too. I want to make sure that we are we are well armed. Um, come, we are well armed. Come, uh, come the next age. Um, those are important too. Uh, yeah, well armed. Come the next age. Uh, do not want to be caught out. Uh, Let's just uh, upgrade all of these houses here. We do not want to be caught out in the next age with, with, with low quality weapons. We need swords. Uh, we need shields. We have composite bows, I think. Quite a few composite bows. Perhaps a few more. Um, and perhaps that's what we will be doing when we expand this out here and we build... Expand Morgoth, which I, I think we still will do. We will still expand to, to include this last gap. Major manufacturing area over here, I think. Uh, be able to help us produce more metals. Uh, I think that metals are going to be a huge thing going forward um, as, as we upgrade. Um, but we're almost at, uh, as we said, we've, we've almost achieved uh, we've almost achieved all we can achieve around these parts. Um, it's been impressive as the storm blasters in there with uh, quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of um, aggression. Um, we've done a really good job, I think, of uh, of uh, building Mugrath up to be quite the quite the quite the, the society here. Um, already doing really good progress here with with converting the, these mud huts to to roundhouses. Uh, I think this is the last one to come down over here. Uh, last hut to come down, almost down. Yeah, there you go. 
And up goes the roundhouse. First roundhouse on this end to be going up. Next one over here. Uh, we are low on the population capacity at the moment. But that's because we took down so many roundhouses all at once. But it is spring. So we can make it. Let's just pause here while we see the foundations of these go up. You can see how quickly we are able to uh, erect these buildings. Um, and which is amazing to see. Um, we should really be able to shoot our population capacity up there. There's almost all six of those are almost all complete. Almost all at once. Uh, it's fantastic to see actually how quickly that little section changed. One, one, one season we were able to upgrade. Uh, population capacity up to 178, 170, up to 75, 180. We're going to jump. And this will take up to 180 by the time we finish over here. Yeah, 180. I think we're up to uh, capacity up to 195, I think. Um, when it comes out to it, 195. Yep, we will have reached total capacity of 195 by the time we have completed upgrading here, just below 200. Just below 200 people in the good city of Morgroth. Um, fantastic, if you ask me. Still space for eight more people. Yep, look at that. 185, 190, 195. Still space for 13 more people, 190. Yep. We've got 177 people currently living in the village, um, which is wonderful. Um, I think let's uh, upgrade these two. See if we can upgrade those two before the end of the end of the season. In fact, we actually may, might be able to upgrade them all. Let's take them all down, or just these four. I mean, do those two at the beginning of next season. So these four will come down. These stone stables will come down. Um, and we'll, all these, uh, I think these stables will come down and we'll put up some stone ones in their place. Um, and population is again jumped up to... We're sitting at a steady population of around 179, around 180. Seems to be our population steadiness where we seem to hover it's quite a lot of people I must say um, taking a while to take put down some of these stables here um, hopefully that means that we'll be able to make it before before winter it was a slightly really risky maneuver um, taking these down and trying to get them up in autumn but you know the way we work around these parts and the balanced workloads it's not too bad I think that we'll be able to do it. Especially if we set high priorities on them. That one's down already. That's three down already. They're already delivering already delivering items to build them up again. I think that we'll probably have those uh those up and running by by the end of uh by the end of uh, autumn. Uh, even though we have uh, quite a lot of harvesting to do. Um, our counts on sickles we have a raider attack to deal with. I was wondering when this was going to happen. Sound the alarm. Everyone can run run home. It looks like we've got a big crew of raiders coming in here. Where are they coming down? They're coming down to approach us. Uh, run home, guys. I want you to run home. Run home, or you're going to get a. Uh, you're going to get uh, attacked. Or maybe they're just ignoring non combatants at this stage. The raiders all coming across the, the, the river here. Let's close gates. They seem to be ignoring our. Um,
Let's open some gates. Oh, these raiders are dying here on the outside. Oh, looks like we missed an upgrade there. Looks like we missed a little bit of an upgrade there. A uh, goat's being killed by a raider. But all in all, those raiders were held off. Let's upgrade that stone. Missed that little upgrade there. But yes, well done, everyone. Those stone walls. A few more, few more weapons. And everyone held off very well. Congratulations. Raiders are not a problem. Oh my gosh, there's more raiders. Wow. There was a second wave of raider attacks. It was quite a slaughter out here. We actually uh, lost a few dogs. We lost a few dogs. We lost a goat. It seems. Um, but yeah, we, the raiders, raiders threw themselves against our walls. Um, yeah themselves against our walls it didn't it didn't seem to, to to have much of an effect uh, let's increase that quickly make sure there's always sticks here to collect there's always a young kid around you can help collect sticks uh, look at that I think even with that raider attack are we gonna make it up we've got one up uh, what are we pending stone oh goodness gracious me we have a stone issue don't we uh, Oh, work here is that's why we've run out of stone. That's terrible. Stone is an issue, so we might lose a few. Uh, we might lose a few uh, animals uh, this winter um, while we uh, just uh, get some stone uh, uh, stone areas up and running again. Let's uh, pump the number of people. We got we got so much so stone happy uh, that we actually forgot to check that uh, we had enough uh, resources to actually uh, collect uh, collect. Let alone uh, is there stone? I know that there's a whole bunch of stone over this side, isn't there? Yeah, look at the stone rich stone area over here. Uh, we're gonna have to jump that up to five people, um, and let's uh, let's do some more stone. Uh, we've got a lot of a lot of stone out the back here. Yeah. Uh, what else we got? We got a workplace. We got a mine ore. Yeah. Uh, let's just put that there. You know. And there's speed up quickly. Um, let's do some more flint gathering over here. Um, since this flint has just been lying around um, and not been used. Um, let's get some stone. There's quite a bit of stone around here. Which can be gathered quickly. We seem to have used all the close by stone. The tin and the iron. Uh, let's see if we uh, build metallurgy. What are we? Iron. Tin. Tin mine. Yep, yeah, there's a tin mine. What's this? Iron. Yeah, we're not at the iron stage yet. And the blizzards are rolling in. Look how cool that looks though with that second stone circle out there. Um, we did not make it to winter before getting these up, which means that uh, we're going to lose quite a lot of animals this winter, I think. Um, which is a pity. Um, I think it's a huge pity. Um, let's actually see uh, if how many we actually do lose. Yeah, we're going to lose a few animals. 
can see them dropping. But we shall build our animal population up again. That was a miscalculation upon my part. I did not look at our stone storages. Always remember to look at stone storages before you do some upgrades. Um, but I think that uh, we have some stone rolling in now. Um, as we've expanded those areas, some carts have gone out to fetch that stone. Um, and these stables will go up fairly quickly, I hope. Um, maybe we will even get one up uh, before the end of winter. Um, I don't think we will, but we might. Um, uh, and let's just hope that more people do not sacrifice themselves out there trying to get that stone, which I've seen a few people have already. Uh, a couple of people have died of hypothermia. Uh, just outside the walls, it seems. With fishing traps. Which is weird. Uh, you know? Uh, anyway. Uh, spending too long fishing, it seems. Uh, who's contracted a disease? You've contracted a disease. Don't pass it on to anyone else. Oh, and she died with the disease. That's disappointing. Okay, that's good. Here comes uh, more stone has arrived. And it, 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 as I said, we might get one of these up before the end of winter, which it seems that we have. Um, might have tr lost a few animals. Um, but there also might be some space for them to keep warm. Uh, we come to the end of winter, so it isn't up before the end of winter. Um, but it'll be there next winter. Um, sorry guys, damaged our population there a little bit, particularly our cattle population. Um, so in fact, actually, that's a good idea. Let's, uh, let, let's, 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 let's pause in here um, and have a look um, at what, uh, what, what we can come and domesticate because we really did take a beating there on the, on the cattle front, particularly. Uh, lots of pigs over here. Cattle front. I'm really looking for cattle. Uh, cattle? Yes, Uruk. Yep. yep. Young male. Cool. Uh, I want, want you. Uh, let's see if there's any Uruks. Are the Uruks around? Oh, there seems to be a bunch down here. Uh, let's just replenish our... Uh, let's replenish our stock, shall we? Our breeding stock. What are you, your dear? You can go down. Um, and you're, you're well donkeys. Uh, I'd love to see some of the, the population coming back up here. Uh, spiking itself back up. These are reindeer. Yeah, lots of lots of wild animals still still populating themselves around these parts. Which is good to see. Um, I think these are deer. Nope. These are wild donkeys. Yes, more, no, bison, okay, and these are pig, boar, boar, yeah, pig, boar, 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 okay, well, I suppose we can have pause, um, yep, get a couple more, um, get a couple more, um, a couple more in there, and a couple more cows into the group, let's go, knowledge progress, let's see how we're doing on the deer, oh, so got quite a few more to hunt, um, although our settlements are, Number of people in our settlements are climbing, um, and I think that we've kind of gotten to the point where uh, let's upgrade these two. Um, we've gotten to the point that once those are upgraded, I think um, that we can uh, we can move to the next age, the next era, um, and I think that's going to be a great way to end this episode. Is moving over to the next era. Um, I think that uh, we do need to find some more deer to hunt. Um, we do need to really uh, up that uh, the deer kill count. Uh, it is our next one of our major major things we need to tick off the list. Lots of mining going on here. Yeah, you can see stone stone gathering. That's what it is. In fact, actually, let's just let's just make sure that we. We really don't ever miss out on the stone, and let's just put up stone, uh, you know, stone gathering up in the hills. Um, yeah, so I guess we need to find more deer. What are you? 
Yo, you can be, uh, you can join our, our family of, our family of, um, ooh, did I see, uh, nope. Let's see if there's any more young ones around here. Wild horses, nope. Yeah, I think we just need more cows. Yep, it is a couple more deer. Some ball will get in the way, I'm sure. But that's what happens. Uh, it's Hanchi Archer. Uh, it's fine. I think that means that once those deer have been hunted, we should be up to a little bit. It shouldn't be too hard to finish the rest of it. Uh, let's just see how these come down. These have come down. Right. We have made some very good progress on episode 22. Um, we have got our stone circle up. We have achieved another another milestone. Um, and we are about to have, I think, come very close to, uh, very close to achieving our, our reindeer or our deer hunting uh, quota, which is 100. Um, we're 25 away. A um, couple more, couple more hunts to go down there, and we we shall have achieved that. And um, what we're going to do here is we're now to end this episode off. We're going to upgrade into the Iron Age. So let's see, Iron Smelting unlock, Deep Mining unlock, Saddle Stones unlock, Hydro Power unlock, Reinforced Fortifications unlock. We've still got three more to go, but we've made a good start into the Iron Age. Um, boom, boom, boom. And this should allow us to really start to up things again. Next episode, we shall take a look into what those hold in store for us. And we should be able to tick off all of our milestones. Um, yep, all of our milestones, we should be able to tick them off. Um, we've unlocked an achievement, or I have Iron Man. Um, so yeah, we should be able to unlock uh, the rest, these last two fairly soon. We're going to have to choose a spot for our third stone circle. I think it's probably some up here, somewhere up this side. Make a triangle uh, for the archaeologists to figure out later on. So wham, got one there. Wham, one over there. Um, and perhaps we, uh, perhaps we put the third one somewhere up here. I'm thinking somewhere on the plains over here, maybe even um, end of the fields. Um, I don't know. Let's actually, to end this episode, drop a, a work area to to gain some flint over here. Up that, so that goes quickly. Um, and it's amazing how we still have flint so close to so close to the civili civilized world over here. Shows you how much uh, how much we've been going far and wide to gather it, and how much how well we've managed to do without it. And that is a good place to end episode 22 um, as we come into autumn. Um, and you can see the final, um, final bits of, uh, harvest that need to take place on the end there. Um, as the villages of Morgoroth come out to gather the last barley and acorn of the season. Food counts looking good, walls strong. Uh, still don't have nearly enough swords. Getting there on the shields. Not enough swords. But uh, nevertheless, a defended village. I'll see you tomorrow in episode 23. I am the Beard. Signing off. <laughs>